You asked me when I knew I wanted to marry you. When I saw how we handled life curveballs together, I knew. When I found that I had someone waiting on me after work to hear about my day, I knew. When I saw how you were so good with kids, I knew. When I saw your true character and found it more beautiful than I had ever imagined, I knew. I've never felt more of a sense of comfort and companionship than you have shown me, and I only expect that to blossom. You've always been such a beaming light to the darkest of night. You're my best friend, my person to laugh and cry with, my constant who grounds me when I need it. You're my home when I need rest. When did I know, you may ask? It was not one big aha moment, but a multitude of small moments. And in each of these moments, I fell more and more in love with you. I was determined to make you my husband, and here we are. <laughs> 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 I'd say you succeeded. I'd yeah. say you succeeded. <laughs> <laughs>
I promise to be there for you when life seems most beautiful, when the leaves are changing and the vibrance of spring is evident. I will be there with you. Who gives this woman to be married to this man? Her mother and I. Awesome, awesome. What got me crying today at the church was right behind them in the backdrop across the lake was a, was a, a cross. And, and most of you probably couldn't see that, but there was a cross and there, a picture of the good grace that God has provided our family. And I pray that they'll provide that in their family and their lives. Bailey, you are one lucky guy. And we are one lucky family to call you Uncle Sarah and Aunt Bailey. <laughs> Here's to many more dinner nights, but at this time it's at your house with a, with a deer head over the fireplace. <laughs> um, cheers to the new Mr. and Mrs. Their respect and love for one another is strong, and I know that we are all thrilled for their marriage and their new lives together. So here's to the new Mr. and Mrs. Senden. Sarah, you're so kind and engaging every time we talk and hang out, and I'm so very thankful for that. And I'm thankful for the way that you love Bailey. On behalf of all the groomsmen here tonight, I want to thank you for allowing us to be a part of your day and it's been an honor of a lifetime to be side by side with you once again. Love you both, God bless, and cheers to the Simmons. <laughs> I promise to love you and cherish every moment with you, whether it is in joy or sorrow, on date nights or if it's sitting on the couch trying to finish Grey's Anatomy. <laughs> I promise to go on adventures with you and I promise to be a good co-pilot and always tell you whenever I see a deer. <laughs> Hi, Bailey. Take you, Sarah, to be my wedded wife. I, Sarah, take you, Bailey, to be my wedded husband. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better or for worse. For rich or for poor. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish from this day forward. Until death do us part, as God is my witness. Until death do us part, as God is my witness. As a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, it is my pleasure to pronounce you as husband and wife Therefore, what God has joined together, let not man separate. Bailey, you may kiss the bride. a better man and to put you before myself. I promise to wholeheartedly show my love for you, to love you intentionally, to promise to love you heart, soul, and mind. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my pleasure to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Bailey Sendin. to be your wife. Let's do this life together. I will love you until forever. I will love you until forever. <laughs>